Hello Little Bookworms, my name is Jojo and me and my cuddly friends would like to welcome you to the Littlest Book Corner. Today is story time, but before we get started I want to ask you a question. Do you ever get those knots and tangles in your hair that are so difficult to get out and really hurt when you tried to brush them out? And do you know how they get there? Well, today's story we are going to find out why. I bet you're wondering what today's story is. Well, let's take a look inside the story time chest and find out. Today's book is The Hair Fairy Tales Save the Tangle Fairies by Duena Gawley and Callista Dawson. Okay, are you sitting comfortably? And do you have your cuddly friend with you? Great, let's get started. Hello, I am the Hair Fairy, keeper of all the hair secrets. Taking care of a head full of hair can be tricky at times. Have you ever wondered where all those tangles come from? I have some friends that will help explain things. Let me introduce you to the Tangle Fairies. These little creatures are a fun-loving crew, always ready for an adventure that is new. Late at night, while you are fast asleep, into your bedroom they start to sneak. They mean you no harm as they creep to your bed. The fairy's favourite place is beside your head. Pillows are perfect for bouncing and fun. They will play all night until morning comes. The problem is, they are not very bright and little wings can get tangled in your hair awfully tight. They will do all they can to try to escape, but when they see it is no use, they will lay down for a break. You will notice each morning when you awake that you have been left in quite a silly state. They are sleeping now and need to rest from all the excitement of a late night fest. These tiny fairies are hard to see, but there is a magical way you can help set them free. Grab your hairbrush, I mean magic wand. You may need some help from your daddy or mum. Sit very still and you might hear them snore through the tangles and snarls and knots galore. Start at the bottom, work your way to the top. Before you know it, you will have saved the whole lot. Now that they are free, they will want to go play. So send them on home to the wind and the waves. Just take your brush, give it a swish, and blow them away as you make a wish. Off they will go, roaming around, twirling and splashing in the mischief they have found. As you're out to play with the wind in your hair or in the bathtub, you may find them there. But there is no need to fret. You know what's necessary. Go find your hairbrush and save the Tangle Fairies. The end. Well, if you have any Tangle Fairies in your hair, you know what to do now. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's story time at the Littlest Book Corner. Thank you so much for joining me and I hope that you'll join me next week for another storytime adventure. But in the meantime, keep on reading. Goodbye. If your little one loved this book, you can get your very own copy by clicking on the link below. Don't forget to connect with us on social media for storytime, giveaways and more. Thanks for watching.